Did they kick you out? Absolutely not. That video is stupid. That child is clout chasing. And that's a kid that did the video. I said, I actually sat on the main stage. Please, how did I get put out the church? They had to, I had to, they had to um, put my credentials in. I didn't have my credentials at first. And they had to look it up. Hmm. Something smells fishy. Almost as fishy as those braids and that uh, rabbit baboon skin vest that he always wearing. And mind you, it's like 67 degrees in Memphis today. So why you got on a full suit and a rabbit skin? I don't know, but I digress. So after doing a little sleuthing, this is what I found. So you see, we have two packages, the general registration and the platinum leadership. The general registration allows you entrance to the convention center main location seating 15 minutes prior to service starting. And the platinum leadership package allows you to preferred seating um, and seating is reserved for up to 15 minutes after service begins. So I'm thinking that the reserved seating is that stage, that platform, that's the reserved seating. And after 15 minutes, your reserved spot is gone. You just got to get in where you fit in. So with that being said, he chose this registration package, the platinum package. But if you see at the top, it says required registration for bishops, supervisors, elected officials, and appointed officials. Now, you want to know the reason why it says that? Let me show you. So you see, when you select that option, this is the screen it takes you to. And at the very top, it says, do you understand that this registration is for bishops, supervisors, national and or elected leaders? Okay. Now, if you miss that part, then right below that in red, they say again, this registration is for leadership only. If you are an assistant or an adjutant, please use the general registration, which means sit your ass on the regular floor. You ain't up on the stage this time. So then you have to confirm that you understand, you know, that improperly selecting this leadership, some, 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 there's going to be consequences and repercussions. Then below that, you have to select which uh, leadership classification fits you. With me so far? So this is where it gets good. You have to pick which of these six titles you fall under. Are you a bishop, a supervisor, an elected officer, appointed officer, a bishop's wife, or the spouse of a supervisor or officer? Now, as much as he desires to be a bishop's wife, and he'll even settle for being a spouse of a supervisor, he is neither. And so he snuck his ass up on that stage, and he thought he had made it. He thought he was with the big wigs. And security came and checked his credentials. These are the credentials they were trying to verify. These are the credentials that he did not have. And this is what led him to be escorted off of the stage and back into general admission. So, why you got to lie, Craig? I mean, you didn't think they was going to check to see where your supervisor tag was, your bishop's title, you, you, you still think that everybody's as dumb as you, huh? Well, I guess you learned this time. And there you have it, folks. Mystery solved.